Hello everyone, this is your Stick, and today we're doing an unboxing and review, well, unpackaging of the Halo Foxtrot Mystery Bag Series. Now, I already have the green guy right there, so I'm going to open up this one. Oh, ooh, what's this? Oh, uh, we got the, the bug guy. Oh man, look how many pieces there are, though. Yeah. I got the bug guy. Oh man, how do you even assemble him? The head. So I'm gonna go ahead and assemble this guy. Can you guys see that? No. Okay. Put my banshee under it. Will it work? Nope. Does my controller work? Try to get that perfect okay, camera angle. Okay, I'm just gonna have to sit down and assemble him. Oh boy. It's gonna be toughy. How do I assemble him? Okay, so let's see. I shove this down here. Is that correct? Correct, Amundo? Okay, let's start with the top. So the top, oh man. This guy looks pretty tough to assemble. This leg here. Wait, wrong one. Okay. I got his legs done. Pretty good. Okay, I need some light in here. There we go. Okay. Can I get that resolution? There you go. Excuse me. So right here we have the guy, with his legs real quick, see him right there. So then next we attach the head of the bug, bam, look at that, his head's on. So next is the arms, so I don't play Halo or anything, I just love the blind bag series and like the Halo sets, they're like way better. And cheaper than Lego. Eh. I used to hate Mega Bloks and like um, all their sets because they were copying Lego. But I've grown to love them because um, they're cheaper and they have a better quality. Also, they're a lot more harder to break than Lego. I like touch a Lego guy and he just breaks. Okay. There's one arm on. Come on. Get that last arm on. Okay. It's getting pretty tough. Oh crap, I 